I don't, I don't know. I just woke up, walked in the kitchen, told myself from this day forth, I'ma start winning, and I did it. If you tired of just existing, get up, get out, get something, and start wishing. Yeah. Uh-huh, uh-huh, whatever right. that you want to do, whatever that you it's think you got, it's yeah. up to you, man. It's stylish. <laughs> okay, week six, and here we are. The guy with Hep C. That be me. <laughs> no. Um, this week, it was interesting. I mean, I got out of the house for once and decided to venture off in this quarantine the land that is, you know... The United States. There's been a lot of talk about what's going to happen with the coronavirus. But again, you know, I'm just going to talk about Hep C and how I'm feeling. You know, the last couple of times I've recorded, it's been weird because it's just been so prevalent. And it's still at least relevant to a major degree. It's just now I'm actually having some type of symptoms. Like, right? Like, I, I, I'm really like when I bend my arm like this. Oh, man, it feels like, okay, so like, you know, like if you land on your arm too long or your body's been laying in some weird position for too long and then you try to stretch it out, that's how it feels all the time, though. And it just be random. Like I'll just sit down in this chair that I'm sitting in and I can't even get up right now. (laughs) But I mean, it's tough. And that's what I'm trying to work through right now as far as, you know, I get really, really tired for one point in time, a couple of days ago, I thought I was, you know, starting to regress back into some uh, familiar situations where I thought I had a damn coronavirus. I said, man, it's crazy, but I don't. And I uh, talked to uh, some of the doctors and we got a lot of the circumstances that were I thought were held poorly or it handled poorly last week taken care of because there was no reason for them to send that medication to the hospital and then have me go up there and mess around with all that crazy stuff and go in there and stuff like that but you know uh one of the people from uh the actual place where i get the medication because this medication is so exclusive and y'all know this medication if you don't know well you you're definitely not getting it without insurance and it's almost $1,200 a pill. So, yeah, it's mad expensive. And they go through, like, this excruciating process where they have, like, some out client uh, people, which is a, li- a liaison, which is somebody who specifically just take care of this field, deal with the people over here, you know, at the hospital. So it was like, it's like a weird disconnect. And then also with the corona, you know, it's it, no one's on the same page. So. But luckily, I I talked to some people. We got it all set up in in two weeks from now when I'll have to uh, get more medication. I already got it set up, so we good. Uh, As far as how I'm feeling, I'm feeling okay. I'm feeling like we got this, man. I'm halfway through with uh, my Hep C medication. Uh, I'm scared, man. I'm scared. Like. I'm going to be able to do things that I haven't been able to do in so long. And f- fear of the unknown is big, you know, like I'm sitting here and I'm trying to, you know, do a lot of different things. And it's it's frightful because people don't care about themselves. And, you know, they go out here and do whatever point. In, for example, people are still going out in public, being really close to other humans, knowing that that's not what the law decreed and I don't care man you can't go up to somebody and be like hey yo back up off me man because you got you might have a virus and I ain't trying to can't go right you got yeah you could but I don't know how long you're gonna be you you're gonna be keep your sanity <laughs> you know so I don't know uh I'm doing okay I'm thankful for another day I'm making a lot of music I'm inspired I'm I'm trying to think of something that I can do to give back and change the world. And hopefully we're just giving a little piece of how I'm doing every week, help somebody else who just is having a hard time because I'm here to tell you that it gets better. And if it doesn't get better, you make it better. And if you can't 
figure out how to make it better. Go to somebody who can help you figure out how to make it better. Get get out of that mindset like I got to figure it out by myself. Don't be dumb. No one gets anything done by themselves. And they're going, you know, just a little nugget of my knowledge at the at the tip. Baby, uh, I'll see y'all next week. All love. Go on.